So today a uh, short video about this one van Makita knockoff impact driver you can buy on the internet or on eBay or so. Um, it's a Makita knockoff 18 volt machine. I think it's a copy of the DTW 700, but I don't think that it's got the torque of the original Makita tool. But for its price, it seems to be very well designed. We've got this fiber reinforced plastic housing. Then you got a brushless motor with ball bearings on the rotor. The rotor has a cooling fan and it has very strong neodymium magnets, so it's not easy to divide these two parts. Then you got a switch with only signal cables to the power main PCB and uh, yeah, you've got no temperature sensing of the battery and I believe these metals are a bit thinner than the original Makita contacts but that's not the problem I believe and so we got this aluminum case here on one side, we got we got this uh, support for the bearing of the rotor, and on the other side, we got a nice ball bearing. All is very good, uh, greased from factory, and here we got the planetary gear. Also, well designed, well greased. And there's the hammer. And this comes in here. It has grooves, maybe grease pockets, I believe. And this aluminum case has a hardened steel bushing on the front. So, very solid, and I believe this is a good machine. So, hopefully the electronic will last a long time. And yeah, for the price, not bad. The DC brushless motor has no hall sensors as feedback for the electronic. Um, I think this is very common on uh, these tools, but okay, it works. I tried to loosen some uh, uh, wheel bolts on my car and uh, I tightened them with 200 Newton meters and this machine got them off. So what's very important is that you use an impact socket. That means a socket that has no clearance and sits tight on the, bo on the bolt. When they wiggle the impact driver is not able to loosen the bolts. So don't make the mistake and take a uh, socket out of a uh, normal uh, wrench set, which has rounded corners and edges so that it could wiggle on the, on the bolt, then it has not the full torque. Okay, so I hope everyone could see this, this the technique in this machine. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. See ya.